Hello everyone, this is Monster and Blobo coming to you with another Kindred Fate speculation video. Today, we're going to be talking about something suggested by V-Senpai. If you have your own suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. But we're going to be talking about holidays in Kindred Fates. And that's a perfect time to do it, just as we round off to the end of the year. And New Year's coming up and Christmas and other holidays just passed. What kind of holidays might Kindred Fates have? Well... One, I think that Kindred Fates having such an emphasis on the idea that you have a strong bond with your kinfolk, you have the whole memorial system and everything in the game where you can go back to the shrine near your hometown and there's a memorial there and you can honor your fallen kinfolk. I think that there's probably going to be some kind of a uh, remembrance type day of like honoring uh lost kinfolk and maybe even lost humans or um summoners as they've been called as a placeholder name so far where both kinfolk and humans can mourn their lost partners and there'll be events about that kind of like the day of the dead is in real life we also know that there's going to be seasons in the game so we could have stuff like a harvest festival we'd have stuff maybe like a winter theme festival kind of like christmas even um one thing I think would be a pretty cool idea is like a peace day where humans and kinfolk come together and basically talk about how they're united and strong together and stuff like that. We don't know a lot about the lore, but perhaps there was something going on in the background where there was a serious conflict, uh, conflict between humans and kinfolk, maybe a war even, and we could see like a peace day where they all come together and talk about how they want to keep this good moving forward so that there's not going to be any more conflicts between humans and kinfolk and maybe it'll be like a bond renewal ceremony or something like that that you could do with your kinfolk maybe do a special mini game that can only happen during this time or something like that that gives you a bonus probably, probably a small bonus to bond with um, all of your kinfolk that you use that day, like any kinfolk that you interact with that day, maybe get a small bonus to their bond increases. Um, another one would be perhaps more of a Halloween type thing. It, like where people dress up is what I mean by Halloween. Perhaps kinfolk dress up as humans and humans dress up as kinfolk in kind of just like a friendly gesture. Not so much making fun of the other side, but more like trying to feel what it's like to be the other side just for a day to get into the head of the uh, kinfolk or get into the head of the humans and just get a teeny tiny glimpse into what it's like to live their life and it's it could be a very sacred and respected holiday in that way there's a lot of other holidays that could possibly transfer over, like literally all the real life holidays could exist in Kinterfates. We don't know a lot about the world. There could already be Christmas and Halloween and Hanukkah and Easter and whatever else you can, uh, holidays you can think of. They could all exist in Kinterfates already. We don't know, but please feel free to leave a comment below and tell me what you think will be in Kinterfates or what holidays you would like to see. And until next time, this is Mostan Bluba signing off. Hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye, God bless, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.